So my wife and I, we clown all the time and we's like, man, there's something wrong with us. It's something wrong with you and me because we don't have no friends. You know, we used to have a lot of friends a long time ago, but we changed, we grew, we evolved, and we just, people fell off along the way. And um, sometimes we think and we like, you know, sometimes we even pray. We're like, God, send us godly friends, like people that's on the same path as us, family oriented, business oriented, like entrepreneurs, people that's going to operate at a certain level. Because if you want to build a circle of friends with high standards, you have to have high standards yourself. You got to start working on yourself first. And we did that. But now it's like we have such high standards that we can't just allow anybody to come through. The reason being is because, like I said before in another video, is that so many people got so many different things going on in their life because they put themselves in them situations sometimes so we're not trying to bring all of that stuff around our family and around the kids because it just we don't need to have all of that you know we need people that's equally yoked with us like if me and my family will sit down and read the bible together we want to sit down with a family that sit down and read the bible together too people that care about their children people the husband and wife that care about each other so we have high standards for our friends because we have high standards for ourselves so if you want to build a circle of friends around you that have high standards you need to first start on yourself figure out who you are and what you want and what you demand of people. I talk to my children about that too and I'm like, look, you can't be friends with everybody. You should kind of interview your friends when you're first talking to them. Like, this is going to be their year. They're going to go to school. We usually homeschool them, but they're going to school this year. Again, this is the second time they're going to school in a long time. We've been homeschooling them for a long time, but I'm like, look, you got to interview your friends. You can't just be friends with everybody. You need to figure out like what they have going on in their life. What do they want to be when they get older? Because you have goals. My children have goals. They have plans. They have ideas and they have dreams and aspirations. So if you're going to get with people who don't have any, you're not going to have any either. If you're sitting in a group of four broke people, you're going to be the fifth one. But if you sit in a group of four rich people, you're going to be the fifth one. It's all about the circle of influence that's around you and the people that you allow to be in your presence. And you got to have a high standards for yourself and don't let those other people come in with that low standards like y'all call nowadays low vibration. Don't let those people come in with those low vibration and low standards and bring you down too. You need to have a higher desire for a quality of life and only allow people around you that have that same desire as well.